NASA calls it an X-class solar flare, one of the most powerful to have erupted from the sun this year. The flare was accompanied by a coronal mass ejection, which scientists say is carrying colossal amounts of electromagnetic energy towards Earth at approximately 3 million miles per hour. When it arrives over the weekend, they say it's likely to produce moderate geomagnetic storms, affecting radio communications and electrical power grids. It's also likely to generate spectacular auroras, or light shows, in the skies over both hemispheres. The storm occurred on July the 12th. Images of the flare were produced by the orbiting Solar Dynamics Observatory. The observatory's telescopes are equipped with a variety of filters to record images in different wavelengths indicated by different colours. The SDO was launched in February 2010 to observe and record images in unprecedented detail during a mission lasting five years. NASA says that mission has so far been a spectacular success. Rob Muir, Reuters.